Hey guys, Benzo Gold here. I'm out in Tennessee today on Douglas Lake with Brewers Prospecting and Scott Sharp. We're doing a little something different today. We're walking the banks, looking for what shows up, but mostly here is what they have, these little quartz that are double terminated, really clear. I've already found a few. We'll be here all day. Hopefully I'll find a few more. Got my digging tool, just a pocket knife. I'm just walking around, see what we get into. Oh boys, they're way over there right now. I started walking this way. Just wanted to look at the geology. The problem here, a knife. We got a lot of glass. So much glass, you can't pick it all up. When you're looking for things to sparkle and stand out. So I was walking around looking at the geology, following the quartz line. Walked around the corner here and then it hit shell. And I turned back around come back this way look for the flint line and that's where I started finding some really good crystals I'll tune back in when I got something to show so far the areas I've done well in areas where you can find heavily mineralized stuff lots of heavy rocks and no none of that shell that shell line is just right over there and at the top I'm looking for streaks of flint and other heavies it seems like that's where I'm finding more of them you see little sparkles and sometimes those little sparkles are little BB size perfectly clear crystals you can collect those but you want bigger ones there's one there super tiny one up here with the guys got a little spot here found a little one but look how perfect that little guy is that's cool let's see if we can find some more following the flint line down we got a nice surface find here let's pick it up and see what it looks like it's not glass nice they're finding crystals over there they're recording some Red Bull break. I was following this down. Found a spot with this red rock. It's like, hmm, good mineralization. Let's look around. Right there. Right on the surface. Nice. We're having a little break right here up at the vehicles. We're getting ready to venture out across to the other side. It's more rocky and not shell. We got to the shell line, turned around. We found some more good ones. Let's go. Looks like the help erosion they brought in. Huh. Golf ball. It's a good golf ball. They brought in gravel through this area. We just gotta find a place where we can cross. Should record everybody crossing. <laughs> it's quite nasty over here. I see somebody tried to go. That looks pretty hard over there. It's either right here or way up. That stuff is hard. It looks like it's, it's, it's loose. That stuff is so hard. There's the rock. Bingo. Already? Yeah. I 
there. Ooh, it's on camera. Nice. I thought this was glass in the mud. I thought I was going to take a chance on it. And I felt the structure and stopped and as I pulled the camera out. Smoky too. Double termination, sharp, really nice. Out here in the mud. Oh, I guess we gotta change the plan. We got run off from down there. There's a old Skippy McGee down there. He thinks he owns the lake bed. Run us off, kinda. So we decided to stick around here and run this one more time. Cause there's so much ground here. There's no way we looked at all of it. Got some really good finds. You ready to find one? Ooh, really nice. Been finding pieces back on this trip, but I got one right here in screen. Still dirty. Here's the hall in the second round. You can see that one there out front. It just stands far and above the rest. There's a few real clear ones, orange ones. We got Jeffrey's hall, yeah. Really good hall. There's so many in there, you can't even pick them out. It's one of those purple. Is that glass? But this is the part of the person of the day, I think. Like double. Hall's pretty incredible because Scott donated his finds to the channel, so we're going to clean these up and sort them out. There's still some, that's not one, that's just a pocket rock. <laughs> so there's going to be so many good ones in here, it's going to be a lot of fun to clean them up. Hey YouTube, that's it from us down here at the lake today. Thanks to Brewers Prospecting and a special thank to Scott Sharp for showing us where the good crystals are and for donating his haul to the channel. Till next time, get in the creek, get that gold, or get in the lake. Some crystals.